you can only solve this coding question if you play video games. So give it an array of sorted integers where each number represents the timestamp in which Timo attacks Ash. Now when Timo attacks, Ash is poisoned for S seconds. Let's say Timo attacks Ash at timestamp 4. Since the poison duration is 3 seconds, she will be poisoned at timestamps 4, 5, and 6. Now if Timo attacks Ash when she is already poisoned, the poison duration will reset. Let's say Timo attacks in 4 and 5. The poison duration will last for 1 second before it got reset at 5 and lasted for 3 seconds. Now your task is to find the total time in which Ash is poisoned. Let's say we're given this array and a poison duration of 2 seconds. Ash has been poisoned in the following intervals with a total of 8 seconds, so we can return 8. Let's go over the doll process. For each of the timestamps, we need to calculate the total amount of time in which Ash is poisoned from this attack. What we can do is take the smaller value between the duration and the difference between the next timestamp and the current timestamp. In this case, the poison lasted for 1 second before it got reset it at the next timestamp. Let's implement the function find poison duration taking the input timestamp and S, rate the results, iterate through the indices, if there is a next timestamp, increment result by the smaller value between the duration and also the difference between the next timestamp and the current timestamp, else just increment results by the duration, return results. 